Well, I think uh, we should, at this stage of the proceedings, the formality, just, you should just tell us what you were telling us before about mm -hmm. how the uh, clinic uh, came about. Well, this is uh, one of the first super clinics to come in from uh, the federal government in the last election for $7 million. Every cent has been carefully managed mm -hmm. and uh, what you've got when you have a look at it is um, it's really quite a state-of-the-art clinic. Uh, it's team-based general practice. It's primarily health. It's, been, it's probably one of the best clinics at this time in Australia. And I think we should be saying with our great local representative, Darren, you should just say a few words about how well, the came about. Well, um, we worked uh, very closely in the lead up to the 2007 election with uh, the GP Association of Geelong and uh, Deakin University's Medical School uh, and we were able to put a very successful proposition to uh, Nicola Robson who was of course our uh, shadow health spokesperson at that time and here we are today, some uh, three years later, so it's fantastic to be here. So congratulations, so with those words I'm going to declare the clinic open, I'm going to declare it open on the basis we believe in investing in GP super clinics, not in cutting services and I do know we also believe in national broadband, not in cutting national <laughs> broadband. I understand that Mr Abbott was so ashamed of his decision to cut the broadband today to turn up to his own event. But here we go, we're at ours. One, two, three. Yay! Anything for granted is a uh, can I say it's just fantastic to be here with Darren Cheesman in Karangamai, opening one of the services that we've invested in. Uh, we believe these GP super clinics will be able to offer people integrated health care in a community like this one. This is the kind of facility that there will be no more of if Mr Abbott is elected. Uh, and Mr Abbott has made it clear today that he will uh, slash our national broadband network. Uh, this maps right around the country. It matters here. Darren was just talking to me about how access to broadband is a big issue in his electorate. And Mr Abbott is basically so embarrassed by his cutback he didn't even turn up to his own announcement today. Uh, once again, this is showing poor judgment. And uh, we are off to... Uh, have some more local discussions, so thank you very much. Thank you very much.